Sports. What's going on guys? Somebody up so back once again with yet another video. What we're doing today, I decided to do a, a little bit of a mobile video, right? As we used to do in the beginning of the channel, we are heading to some other, I don't even know where we're going. I think it's in Queens somewhere, some place called Rosedale. We got some uh, errands to run, right? so to speak. It's a surprise, I don't want to tell you guys anything. But without further ado, let's introduce the video, right? Today's video, of course, as we know, we are in the beginning of the new month and that warrants a pesos, perceptions, perceptions, the peso. Right? So we're gonna have it right back in effect. Like, comment, subscribe, obviously. And let's uh, talk about what we usually talk about on these blasted videos, right? These monthly checkups, right? Uh, self-diagnostics. What we do on a piece of perceptions for the people that have joined the channel in the past month, um, which has been a considerable amount, right, um, is we just give a checkup on our mental health, how's our senior retention journeys going, how's life going, interpersonal relationships, intimate relationships, if any, the employment. If I didn't say employment, then we talk about employment. And of course, plans for the channel, future plans for the channel, what we plan on doing, what we plan on uh, talking about, who we plan on featuring, all that kind of stuff. So let's uh, let's begin with employment, right? It's not a piece of perception unless we talk about employment. <laughs> let's talk about employment. Okay, so naturally I've been in this same job working for the city for the past couple of months now. Um, we are getting more and more deep into the singularity point of what is going to pave the way of the behaviors to expect week by week in this office for the future. <laughs> the people that really didn't take that apart or elucidate that. Um, basically, we're understanding how to deal with the manager that we have. She's, <laughs> she's, a, she's a, a brash one, a brazen one, right? She came, she saw, and she conquered, and she annoyed the crap out of Sombra del Piso, right? <laughs> but it's okay, it's a means to an end. Joan of Arc, went through a similar travise, right? In order to preach the word of God and, uh, you know, pave her way for the way of France. So this is nothing, this is all nothing. Right? Um, but she's annoying though. The long, the tall, the short is, we have employment. It's been paying pretty well. Uh, we've been saving and we, uh, we're basically putting all this money that we're saving towards the future of the channel, which is more travel, more exploration of this, uh, this uh, terrestrial sphere, right? So let's talk about the semen retention journey, right? How's semen retention? How's celibacy? So it's been going incredibly well. Um, we've been uh, 11 months in the practice. It's been lovely, honestly. I'm gonna be completely honest. It's been, uh, the journey has been a little fluctuating, right? Um, it's been difficult sometimes. I'm still focused on semen retention and i.e. if I'm focused on semen retention, I'm focused on the channel, the well-being of the channel, because they're inextricably linked. I've been on this streak for as long as the channel has been alive, right? Which I want to talk about, actually. Semen retention has been going great. A lot of energy, a lot of uh, excitement, a lot of spontaneous uh, actions, which, is which are compelled um, to be in existence because of these crazy ideas, right, that come about due to being on the practice for so long. And for the people that don't know, right, I've been on this streak for going on 11 months now, right? Um, it's been a wild journey. I've been thinking a lot. I've been sleeping a lot, doing a lot of working out. It's a lot, man. I'm telling you. I don't, what, what am I going to tell you? What am I going to tell you? Um, you have to get on this practice and you have to understand where I'm coming from by be, like, encompassing this journey on your own. Go on the practice of sleep retention for longer than two months. Trust me, you're going to understand this. Let, can I tell you the truth? Guys, I'm going to tell you the truth. There is a disconnect from reality, well, well from, you know, this subjective reality, right, of people's thoughts, the prevalent ideas and thought forms of other individuals. Basically, eh, maybe you shouldn't be filming uh, in certain spaces, right, because it's not recommended to do so. But you're on SEMA retention. You can do whatever the hell you want until, you know, you get um, assassinated. Hopefully it doesn't happen to some of you guys, but <laughs> hopefully it doesn't happen to me. But you know what I mean, right? All in all, semen retention is giving me like this energy, like this confidence to just do things. I just, I don't know how to explain it, man. It's been like that for the past couple months and it's gonna continue to be that way as long as I go. So get on the practice. If you guys aren't on the practice, if you guys are questioning your various journeys, continue, stay the course. And then you could do what you like, right? 
what's next, right? We're gonna talk about relationships, right? Let's talk about relationships. It's been interesting, man. Um, the interpersonal relationships, as you know, like when you're on this practice, no one likes you, right? No one's gonna really like you. You're gonna be on the practice for a while. I gotta hand in my ticket. Uh, here we are, guys. It's the ticket I gotta hand into the uh, the wonderful lady here. Hi, how are you? Morning. You? Pretty good. Next time, buy the city ticket for five dollars. That's what I was trying to find. That was okay. the recommendation I got. On the machine, you can either from the window. Yeah. Download train time. You can do it on there. Buy your ticket on the phone. Oh. Or at the machine. It's the lower right hand corner should say other ticket types. Mm -hmm. Should be in that, or you'll see like a senior ticket, should be city ticket. Because I selected ticket. off peak, so I thought that was That's the way just to go. the time you travel during the week is peak, during rush hour. Of course, yeah. Yeah, so just should be other ticket types, lower right hand corner. Lower right. Where you buy the senior ticket, family fair, stuff like that. Thank you. All right, no problem. You're a blessing. All right. Well, the next time, guys, that we go to Rosedale, we're going to take the, the woman's advice and buy a cheaper ticket. All right. So we're a little bit on the move now. Only good for the day they're purchased. Okay, you perfect. Want to make sure you're riding that day. Yeah, exactly. Okay, thanks. Yeah. We're on the move now, right? We're in, we're in a tunnel, right? A subterraneous cavern, right? Sort of crafted out by human beings due to like diamond tipped drills. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I, I have no idea. I'm just assuming that's how they did it, right? Because they did that for the Elizabeth line in England. Let's continue. So interpersonal relationships, they don't exist because you're on semen retention. No one's going to really like you. Your energy is different. It speaks before you speak with your mouth, you're just gonna get marginalized, you're just gonna get isolated. In the beginning of your journeys, for people that don't really experience that kind of uh, indirect vitriol from the individuals around you, then you're going to be like, <laughs> it's gonna mess with your mind a little bit, but it's nothing, guys. seriously, I always say this in all my videos, guys, this is nothing, man. All this stuff is nothing, all of this is nothing. Anything that can be done to you in the physical reality, right, in terms of you know, getting your emotions played with, the matters that's doing your head in, right, as the British would say. That's nothing, dude, that's nothing. Don't think that buying a chain and a car and some sort of very expensive Balenciaga shirt is gonna solve your issues, because it's not. You are still having to deal with the physical reality and the objective reality, right, which does whatever it wants. So, it's fine. Like, if you guys are experiencing your isolation from friends, trust me, it is all for the greater good and you're going to be happy. Anyway, intimate relationships. For uh, people that have been, um, oh, we're outside now, look at this. For people that have been following the live streams, um, there's been a little situation that has sort of alluded, right, or brought up the idea of an intimate relationship. I'm here to tell you that I am not going to sacrifice the channel or the message of the channel for some relationship because that means I wouldn't be following my own advice, therefore I am incredible. Not credible. I am incredible. I hope. But I'm not gonna be credible if I don't follow my own advice. And the words of Leonardo DiCaprio, The Wolf of Wall Street, I'm not for leaving, right? I'm not for leaving. I'm gonna put the channel first. You guys are first. Everything else comes second. I care about you, I care about the channel, I care about the direction of us, the community, so. The intimate relationships are going to be put in the heel, right? You know, stepping on the snake's head or something. Good reference, too. So that's what's going on with interpersonal, intimate relationships. Mental health, right? Mental health. Uh, it's been up and down, man. I, I reckon it's because of the change of the seasons. Honestly, as you know, we're in fall now. It's going to get a little colder. Um, I could imagine that next month, for our priestess perceptions for November, I'm going to have to be wearing a jacket because it's going to be so cold. My mental health is still solid, man. We're, um, I'm sort of understanding, I feel like I'm becoming a bit more robust. I'm understanding a little bit about the angles of attack and the layers of attack, right, from the individuals around me, the groups of individuals around me. Remember, this, this, for you guys that are advancing on your personal journeys, right, um, this is never a direct attack. They will never directly attack you because they can't, right? because it's not, they're not following a rule of some sort. They follow rules, these individuals. So they indirectly attack you. They attack you with showcasing of ideals that you should sort of fall into as an individual, indirectly attacking your habits, right? Why the heck won't you drink? Why the heck will you not take drugs, right? This is what everyone does. You're silly if you don't do it. Guys, hold the line, please. I'm telling you, hold the line. Guys, I'm telling you. You will feel so much better right having suffered 
these little things that like no alcohol, no drinks, no, you know, no sex, no women. And then the glory of actually experiencing this, uh, this finite life that we're currently locked in, you know what I mean? Talking from personal experience, of course. So I sort of encompass that mindset and that's the reason why my mental health has been so good. So do as you will, you know, do what you want, guys. Um, but this is just my recommendation, All right? Also, I've started to naturally fast a little bit more. Like there are some days where I would just like fast in the morning, I don't eat any breakfast, and then I just carry on with my life, you know? Um, working out has been really good too. It's interesting though, let me talk about the gym, right? As you guys know, I've been going, you know, at this, since I have this new office job, I've been going to the gym in Queens, Corona. You know, uh, we still, uh, you know, are liked generally, right? By the public there. But, you know, like, we got women that ignore us now, we got guys that switched up. This is all part of the practice, man. And I'm telling you, for someone that is just getting into semen retention and starting to experience these effects, which are inevitable, it's so tumultuous to your psyche, it's gonna shake you up. I'm telling you, you're not gonna understand. You're gonna try to find a logical basis as to why they're treating you this way and you're just not gonna get an answer. That's just the long, that's all the short of it. Remember, guys, when you are feeling down, when you're feeling a little lost, come to this community, please, and ask questions. I'm gonna answer your questions. I'm never gonna give up on you guys, never. So feel free to come ask a question. Right, so that's that with mental health, honestly. Stay solid, stay focused, and stay concentrated, and stay radiant always. Um, let's talk about plans for the goddamn channel. Right? Let's talk about plans for the goddamn channel. So what we have done already, right, is that we've uh, created a membership, as you guys know, the Shadow Collective. As, uh, as of uh, this current moment, right, this date in October, 2024, we have 41 members in the goddamn collective. <laughs> we have increased the the the, the 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 legion, right? Way more than the last month. I think last month we had like one or two members when I made the pieces perceptions. Now we got 41. Um, I have to give some shout outs, of course, because you know I, I wouldn't have reached that number if it weren't for the efforts of the people that you know subscribed. Um, and the person, there were uh, two people that has gifted a lot of memberships. I have to give one, Pinar Pinar. Woman from Turkey, thank you so much for gifting all the members that you did. I feel very, very um, blessed, honestly, that you even wanted to buy into this idea. I think this is amazing. The other members, of course, we got Tobias. I gotta shout him out. We got um, YF, solid dude on the channel. We got, of course, like I said, Pinar. Um, who else do we have? Uh, Hung Solo. <laughs> Imagine yelling this on the train. Hung Solo. <laughs> we got Steph, of course. Wonderful, beautiful Steph. Um, we have, I'll give you guys a shout out, don't you worry. Now, for the uh, members, right? I, of course, you guys have been getting access to interviews, like a lot of exclusive interviews. So we are gonna continue that. We are planning to do a couple more, hopefully this week. And we're gonna give you guys the exclusive content that you guys are paying for, right? Because you deserve it. So get that, and of course, if you're a member as well, you get access to special emojis, which is also a good thing, it's always a good thing. Right, so that's, um, we're gonna bolster the membership program for the channel. Other plans, right? Life is life in, right? We got a lot of work to do in life. Of course, we don't have any, um, you know, wife to take care of, no kids, right? No debts to pay off, no diseases. So, um, as a result, is the next stop Jamaica? Uh-oh, no, I think it's going to Jamaica. I think it says, I never take these trains. I don't know what the hell is going on. I think it's gonna say Jamaica outside, you know, when we get to Jamaica, right? Or, this place that we're going to. Anyway, um, like I said, life is life and we got stuff to do. Um, so I don't, it's gonna be a little difficult to not only film content, but edit content as well. I started to see it as a challenge to keep up. So I'm here to say, of course the content is not going to shrink, right? And even if you're not a member, I'm still gonna provide very, very good content. Just understand that instead of the five times, six times a week that I post videos, it's gonna be like three, four times a week, right? Three to four times a week. And of course, I'm reducing um, it to maybe three or four because the members um, have an exclusive day where they'll get exclusive content. So there's that. Um, become a member, guys, become a member if you guys want to, right? You have access to that, uh, that special interview and the special videos. So that's that, man. I think I should talk about the live stream scheduling now, right? 
And for the most part, um, we do every Friday. Let's, you know what, let's start from Sunday. Sunday, we live stream um, from either one o'clock or five o'clock, right? Or a little, you know, between one and five, and then whatever, whenever we do start between that time, we're going to, you know, go on until we go on, you know? Um, so that's Sunday. Monday, of course, we live stream from five o'clock or 5.20 because we're gonna be in Queens, we're gonna be in the gym. You're gonna guys, you guys are gonna see us do some gym working out, man. Whatever the day may be, chest, back, triceps. You know, we got a solid dude that we work out with. The guy is de Ecuador, right? Uh, some person from Ecuador. And he, this guy is nuts, man. But I, what is that? Iron sharpens iron? Or steel sharpens steel? Uh, something like that. So anyway, we're gonna get stronger together. So that's, that's that. Um, we're supposed to be doing legs on Monday. Um, what else? Uh-oh. Win Jamaica already? Guys, this is nuts. All right, we got to continue the Pisos perception outside because we, uh, we're already here in Jamaica. I thought it was going to take a long time to get here. The things are just happening so quick. Right? Jeez. Much to our detriment, mm, it all depends on the context, right? So, guys, we're going to see you on the uh, once we get on the goddamn platform. Right, so, Sermon of Piso, back once again, right? So, we're gonna go over the live scheduling, the live stream schedule. So, I think I did, I said Sunday, right? We already said Sunday, where it's gonna be from, either from one o'clock to five o'clock onwards, right? We're gonna check that out. Monday, we work out, I think I was talking earlier about my guy from Ecuador, as we're now training buddies, we're now gym partners. We usually work out together, you're gonna see him more on the live streams. That's gonna be on Mondays from five o'clock or from 5.20. Then we have Tuesdays, sometimes I'll do live streams Tuesdays, but for the most part, it's gonna follow the, the Monday format, which is just live streaming in the gym, right, in Queens. Wednesday, that's gonna be a day on my own for myself because I need those. I can't just devote my entire life to the goddamn channel, even though I'd really like to. So we'll see, but no, for the most part, just Wednesdays are gonna be for me, and it's always been for me. No live streams then. Thursdays, right? We all know what happens Thursday. It's going to be a live stream for sure, but um, that's going to be a Summit of the Shadows live stream. That's going to be about semen retention. We come in, uh, it's, going to, it's a different format too. You guys can come onto the live stream and I send like a sort of link, an invitational link for you guys to click. You guys come on the goddamn pla uh, panel, you chat about semen retention. We have like a little discourse and you guys go about your happy way, hopefully a little smarter after you know we've shared some information together, right? With each other. That's that. Um, by the way, on Monday and Tuesday, possibly Tuesday live streams, not only we're doing the gym, but we're also gonna do like some cooking live streams, right? Uh, well, there's gonna be some cooking involved in the live streams because uh, I have to eat. I have to get my, my, my protein. I gotta get my calories, man. My healthy, complex carbohydrates. So we're gonna show you guys how I prepare that as well. That was a, you know, a recap of Monday and Tuesday's live streams. Thursday, you know, uh, Summit of the Shadows, Senior Retention live stream, and Friday, the most popular live stream of all, IRL. This is when we're gonna go hang around in this beautiful world, interestingly designed prison, and then we're just gonna sh show you guys a good time. That's really it. Uh, we do that from either, you know, if we remote work on Fridays, we're gonna be doing that from either 3.30 or four o'clock. If we don't remote work on Fridays, best believe that we're going to do it once we get back home, so that's gonna probably, we'll see. Play by ear, we're gonna play by ear. Hopefully we continue continuously remote work on Fridays so we could uh, keep starting the live streams early. Fridays we go everywhere, anywhere we want. We go to Queens, we go to Bronx, we go somewhere in the city, Midtown Manhattan, uh, maybe Staten Island, who knows? Once our transportation methods um, improve, best believe we're going anywhere we please, <laughs> right? And I didn't mean for that to rhyme, my, gee, my guys. <laughs> So that's that, that's Friday. Saturday, we do. Uh, we spend that day recording, editing, of course. So we're going to uh, continuously do that, right? We're not going to do a live stream then. So that's the live stream, guys. Um, schedule, obviously, I'm gonna put it again in the community board. I wish there was some way to pin it because a lot of you guys ask this stuff all the time. So that's, that's sort of not gonna really change, really at least not for the foreseeable future. So we went over the live stream scheduling, right? That's the, uh, you know, part of the channel's improvements. What else? Probably in this new month, we're probably gonna introduce more different series. 
Always we talk about SEMA retention, always we talk about our ideas about life and whatnot, and how that relates to SEMA retention, how you can sort of understand the various levels of life via SEMA retention. Yes, 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 we talk about that all the time. But uh, we are going to touch up on different aspects too. I wanna to try to talk more about finances a little. Just as important as SEMA retention is the freedom to utilize that energy without any barriers or obstacles, right? So to do that, we need finances. We're gonna talk about um, ways to try to express creativity, to try to gain a little bit of money, right? A little bit of finance, right? I don't know, we're gonna check it out, guys. Just stick with us. The guys that have been coming through to the, uh, the channel and liking the new content, I've been so, I'm so happy. I feel very, very blessed for you guys. Thank you, th f blessed because of you guys. Thank you so much. The channel grew to, in to crazy lengths. Let's talk about a truth right now. Fun fact, the 23rd of this month will mark an entire year that I've been on YouTube providing content. In a year, we got 20, 2,500 subscribers. <laughs> Nuts. Of course, that's important to some degree. What's more important is that there's a good amount of that 2,500 that has joined a, a, the community. Not necessarily become a member, but they consistently come around, comment, um, they show love in the live streams. They have uh, recommendations of how, what to do, how to do things, all that stuff. So I feel incredibly blessed. And I know it's due to the practice of similar intention. When I started the channel, I started my, this current streak. So I feel incredibly, incredibly, incredibly happy. We've met solid people and the channel is only gonna grow from here. I'm so excited, man. Jeez. How can I even express it? <laughs> I'm so happy. You don't even know. Guys, I'm so happy. Um, and we're going to continue to grow. I am not, I'm going to, I s swear on my soul, right? <laughs> no, stop. I swear though, I will not ever put anything before the channel. I will not put anything ever before the community. I'm very grateful. Thank you guys for everything. Seriously. And we're going to keep growing. We're gonna keep growing, we're gonna keep expanding, and I'm gonna show you guys way more content, way more angles of thought, so we can try to make something up in this finite time that we have in this prison reality, man. That's about it. So with that being said, that is all I have to say today. If you guys enjoy that kind of content, like, comment, subscribe, share the video with some peers. Don't ever let this place get you down. We're in a prison, right? But we have to make do. We have to try to be happy. Don't try to listen to the things of the people around you, right? Don't try to succumb to the ways of the people around you because you're just gonna lose. That's just what it's gonna be. You play by their rules, you're gonna lose, right? The moment you tie yourself to the things of the world, you're going to suffer, you're going to be sad. Not saying that suffering is avoidable when you don't you know, follow the things of the world, but it's definitely manageable. And that's something that you want to, want to do, right? You are on a different level of vibration, which means that you are dodging uh, inevitable calamities that will happen to the people that tie themselves to the world. You already know this, guys. So don't ever let this place get you down and stay radiant. I shall see you guys in the next piso. Perceptions, perceptions, the piso. Cha, 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 cha. Woo!